Hi everyone, it's Kylie from Painwing. In today's video, I'm going to be giving a little update on some of the projects I've been working on. For the past couple months, I've been prepping artwork for some shows in Minneapolis. One of these events is at a boutique gallery. For this event, I'm bringing eight pieces. I'm bringing four small paintings, two medium-sized paintings, and then two larger ones. So here's a Baltimore Oriole I painted. And then I also painted a flying chickadee, since chickadees are super popular. This painting is 13 by 13 inches, and then the paper is mounted onto a cradled panel. I posted a video a couple months ago showing how I made these panels, if you want to check it out. And then I also thought it'd be fun to create some pairs, so here's a pair of eastern bluebirds. I don't often paint branches, but I thought I'd kind of tie the two together. And then here's one of the larger paintings I created. This here is of an egret. And then with this painting, I got a little creative with. While I was gluing my panels together, I accidentally got glue on the paper. So instead of freaking out or restarting, I decided that I was going to do an abstract background on this piece. So I ended up adding that technique to all my larger paintings. So it's here on this sandhill crane. And then I also painted a pair of cardinals. Cardinals are one of my most requested birds, so I usually always show them. But I want to do something a little different this time, so that's why I created a pair. And then here's a common loon. I again used that abstract background technique. But this time I decided to use blue to kind of represent the water. I decided to throw a loon into the mix because they're the state bird of Minnesota. And even the non-bird nerds love them. And then the last bird I painted is a great blue heron. So I'll be dropping these off and then I'll show you guys a little preview into the show. A week later was the opening reception. I'll show you guys my paintings and then some of the other artwork that's on display. Another thing that's been keeping me busy is getting print orders out for the holidays. I make all my prints at home using a Canon printer and watercolor texture print paper. I used to order prints online, but I had a hard time guessing what people would want to order, and my prints would often come back with color issues, so making them myself is my current solution. The final event that I'm prepping for is the MCAT art sale. MCAT is the art college I attended and every year they have a huge sale in the fall. I won't be attending the event this year, but I'll show some of the paintings I created for it. One of the paintings I submitted is the chicken I'm working on in this video. Unfortunately, I don't have a lot of footage of me prepping for the event because I've been super busy.
And then here's what the piece looks like after I mounted it to the cradled panel. And then I also painted this great horned owl for the event. This is one of the largest watercolor paintings I've created. This here is 28 by 34 inches. And then I'll show a few other pieces I submitted. But otherwise, that's all I have for today for an update. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're interested in seeing more behind the scenes content like this, let me know. Either way, I hope you have a great rest of your day.